Hey buddies, what's up? How are you? How's everything? Guys, I am here in the forest and I have got a spring and you can see the water is coming from the stream from the top of the mountains and here what we are looking for guys I am looking for some aquatic plants maybe I find here some plant for my aquarium so let's see what we have got so uh, I am moving ahead maybe I find something which is useful for us so guys here on the stone I have got something for you and here you can see I have got land moss but it is quite small and here we have got another piece of moss on the stone here you can see and I show you um, I am picking it up for you guys and you can see it is looking quite different from the normal land mosses so let's see what we have got here we have some moss okay guys let's move ahead and see what we have got ahead so here we have moved ahead away from some water and guys here I have got something for you and here I show you we have got a lot of land moss here and you can see it is quite fresh and very dense and you can see the colors as well it is looking quite healthy as well and it has covered a lot of area so we are going to collect it and for collecting purpose guys you can use knife cutter or some blade I have got a cutter so I will collect it with the help of the cutter and then I will take it home and then we will do the further treatment so here I am looking for some healthy piece okay guys now we have moss here at home and now we are going to see here I show you I have got this piece of moss and I show you from the close and you can see the texture and the color of the moss and here we have got another piece here you can see and the moss have got some soil with it so here you can see I have got another big piece and it has got the soil so what we are going to do we are going to clean the soil and some other bacteria or the dirt and for cleaning purpose we are going to use the water and here we are going to add the water in this pot and later on we are going to add the moss in the water So for cleaning purpose I am going to add the moss here in the water and we have to put it gently so that it may not get damaged. So I am going to add up all the pieces as you can see so that we may remove the garbage or other bacteria which are harmful for the aquarium or other fishes. So we will add and wash the moss in this water and we are gonna leave the moss for 24 hours in the same position and after that we are going to add it to the aquarium and I will tell you that how we are gonna add it into the aquarium mm, now it's been 24 hours and most of the pieces are settled down so here we have got one piece of the moss and now we are going to attach here on this stone 
and here we have got some soil but don't worry so we are going to attach it like here and I am gonna attach with the help of a string here you can see you can use some gorilla glue as well but right now I am using this so you have to gently wrap it up so that it may not damage the moss and here we go so here we have attached the moss on the stone and you can see now we are going to add it into the aquarium so here we have got the planted aquarium and you can see here we are going to put it inside and here we are making some space for this moss and here we are going to put it and guys remember one thing for the growth of land moss you need moderate lighting and co2 is also very sportive and if you have got co2 in your plant tank then the chances of growth becomes brighter and here you can see the moss is looking quite healthy and I hope that it will grow further and faster and guys I am gonna update you in my further videos about the moss so guys thank you very much for watching okay thank you so much bye bye